G'day cheeky dogs, my name's Margie and I'm an Australian currently living in America. And today's video is going to be all about Chili and how much she has changed over the years because we have nine images of Chili from different points in her life, different times that she was animated to different styles, which is a lot. It's a lot more than we have of Bandit or even Bluey herself. So let's definitely talk about it because in particular there are two different images of her pregnant and I'm really excited to dive into those. Now we do only have mostly just pictures. There's nothing back from the 2016 pilot with Chili actually in it. That's just Bandit and Bluey. And if you haven't seen my breakdowns of those videos, I'll leave some links to them in the description box down below. But in the 2017 pilot, we do finally get to see her and hear her as well. And the voice actress is still the same as what we see in current day. It's Melanie Zanetti. Okay, I'm just popping out for a tip. I'll see you later. I'm just going for a run. I'll see you later. But I don't think that she's the voice of young Chili in fairy tale. Is this your hat? Here you go. Thanks. See you later. Which of course is why that Chili is kind of up for debate. Like, is it Chili? Is it Brandy? Is it another dog? Is that Mum? That's Mum. Don't listen to him. It wasn't me. Don't listen to her. It was. I did a theory video for that. But for today's video, we're going to focus on it being yes. Chili. So let's have a look at the timeline of what we've got. We have a four-year-old Chili from the family photo in season three. We have an eight to ten-year-old Chili from the episode Fairy Tale in season three. We have a Chili in her late twenties, maybe early thirties, for her wedding photo in the episode Puppets from season three. We have Chili in her early thirties from Baby Race. We have Chili in her mid-thirties with a photo of her from Sydney where she is pregnant, again from the episode Puppets in season three. And then we have her in like sort of her mid to late thirties in the 2017 pilot. The 2017 images for the press where again one of them she's pregnant one of them she's not and the season one early chili designs in the first few episodes as well as our general designs for her in the later half of season one season two and season three so let's start off with those pregnancy pictures first so the very first one a lot of people thought was just fan art but it is not. It came out well before the show was ever aired. So it is not fan art. It is from an official press media release as well. It was on the Screen Australia website. It is from an article way back in 2017 before Bluey came out in 2018. So initially they did actually have Chili as being pregnant in this. I know they also had Bingo as being a boy initially as well. So it was more that Peppa Pig dynamic, but it did eventually get changed into her being a little girl. But obviously they decided to scrap this idea and not make her pregnant because another image that came out just after that was again showing them all at the beach, just some slightly different designs, but with her not being pregnant. Now the second pregnancy photo though, of course, from the episode Puppets in season three, we know Chili was actually pregnant in this. And we know with what kid as well, thanks to the design. So she is at Sydney Harbour. She obviously has a slightly more rounded belly. She's got a little tuff of hair. But if you look at her brown patch, she's actually got a few gray hairs in that, which means that this happened after the episode Baby Race, because she has no gray hairs in Baby Race, which means that the little dog that's inside her belly is obviously Bingo, not Bluey. Although of course, again, it could be up for debate as to whether it's maybe another child. And again, that rainbow theory, which of course I have done a theory on, and many people have talked about that before, but I honestly think that it's Bingo inside her belly for this picture because she looks so happy in it and it's one that the girls know to show as well. So I think it's Bingo. Now in my last two evolution videos, I did talk about the changes in voice and attitude with both Bluey and Bandit, but there really hasn't been a lot with Chili. Her voice actor, as I mentioned before, has stayed the same except for in fairy tale. You will dance with me tonight at the Grand Theatre. And as for the attitude, the real biggest difference is probably season one Chili versus season two and season three Chili. So in season one, it was very much about Bandit and the girls. The focus was mostly on them. I used to work with that guy. However, we also, in Chili's original bio on the website, it was a little bit mum shamey saying that like she couldn't keep up because she was working and being a mum. And they did actually eventually change this, which was definitely for the better, I think. And as I said, in season two and season three, we see more of a focus on Chili with the girls and as the whole family. And season three in general, we definitely see both her and Bandit shown as more realistic parents being hung over and also just being stressed and especially with Chili sometimes just needing 20 minutes to herself which is super relatable as a parent and as a mum. Right dinner's in the slow cooker and they've had afternoon tea. I need 20 minutes when no one comes near me. 
cheeky dogs. If you've been enjoying this video so far, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below and leave a comment. It really means a lot to me into helping build my channel and the YouTube gods also seem to like channels that have lots of likes in them as well. Now, as for Chili's design and how that's changed over the years, unlike Bluey and Bandit, her color scheme has stayed basically the same. There's only a few little details that have really changed. And that are her spots, her brown patch over her eye, her gray hairs, and just her hairstyles in general. So let's start off with the spots. In the 2017 pilot, we can see that she has three little spots on her tail and it's similar in the season one first few episodes. But when she is four years old, she only has two spots. And in her final design, she has a long white spot and then two little spots as well. And we can also see this design on some of the 2017 stills. So obviously they were playing around with it still a little bit as they were making it. As for the brown patch and the gray hairs, in the series, it is always on the right side of her face and it curves over her cheeks. However, only after Blue is born, does she start to get the gray hairs forming on that brown spot. And then she starts to get even more gray hairs after Bingo's born as well. In the 2017 pilot, however, she has no patch over her eye at all. And in the still images, when she's pregnant, the patch is on her left side of her face, which is why some people thought that this was fake originally. So I filmed this well before the full 2017 pilot was released. Also on a side note, what is going on with all the released pilots? But when I filmed this, it was only the first one minute of it and we only saw one of her designs, whereas now with the full five minutes of it released, we can see that Chili's design changes multiple times. Sometimes she doesn't have a brown patch, sometimes she has it on the left, sometimes she has it on the right, and it is consistently changing all throughout this five minute pilot. Also, yes, you may hear my children in the background here. But we can also see bandits changes as well during this. So obviously they were still playing around with the idea of what they really wanted for their designs. And we already knew that as well from the concept art that was coming out as well at that time. But later on, we do see it switch back to the right, but it goes over her cheek and it stays like that in some of the early season one episodes as well. It's not till the later half of season one that they sort of maybe noticed this and they moved it to go back behind her cheek again. And of course, Chili's had a few little hairstyles when she was in fairy tale. She had a lot more sort of tufts of hair, little fringe going on her own little mullet. And then we see that mullet come back again in that photo in season three. So I love that like we're starting to see them have hairstyles even though they can't really have a lot of hairstyles going on. Overall Chili really has had the least amount of design changes. She's a little bit more consistent than the others but of course her pregnancy changes have been like the biggest part of her. So I'm curious if she was to be pregnant again in the show maybe if they brought that idea back in again what kind of design would you like to see for that little puppy? Would you like to see like a rad version of design where it's half blue and half red? Would you like it to be another little girl, little boy? boy, twins even perhaps? Let me know in that comment section down below. I'd love to hear your ideas about what Chili's maybe future baby could be. But like I said, I have already done a video about Bluey and Bandit as well. So if you cheeky dogs would like to check them out, I'll leave them up here for you. But until then, I will see you in another video. Mwah! Bye!